Hey everyone, welcome to Globe Guys here in Santiago de Chile. We're about to take a flight to Buenos Aires on board a KLM Boeing 777-300 in economy class. Now some of you may be wondering why we're travelling the Dutch National Airline between two South American cities. And the answer to that is, is it's what's known in the industry as a tag on flight. This occurs when an airline can't necessarily make two destinations work, but instead they serve, serve two destinations on board one flight. We're taking one such flight today. Um, it's going to be an interesting flight for uh, the Globe guys to take, so why not come with us and enjoy the ride? So here we are on board, we're on board a KLM 777-300 series in economy class and the configuration in this cabin is 343 or 10 abreast and just before we get underway I'd just like to go into uh, tag on flights a little bit more. So I mentioned this is a tag on flight and these used to be really common years ago before the days of code shares and um, alliances. Uh, but they, they do still exist, this is one such flight, British Airways do quite a few tag on flights within the Caribbean and um, I think some of the Middle East carriers do it as well so I think um, Qatar Airways do a flight between Buenos Aires and Sao Paulo for instance so they do still exist and it's a great way to get on board a big aircraft on a short flight and also you, you, you do still get some long go comforts as well with that so for example we have um, pillows on every seat so we're just waiting for everyone to board. It's busier than what I thought actually because generally uh, tag on flights can be quite quiet as well because the passenger load is being split between two destinations. So it's busier than what I expected. So we're just waiting for everyone to get on board and uh, we'll be underway shortly. Coming through our arm flights. Ladies and gentlemen, a very good afternoon. My name is Marcel van Dichten. Together with my colleague Joris van der Roy, we are the persons on this flight to Buenos Aires. On behalf of the whole crew and KLM, once again, welcome on board of this flight to, like I said, first to Buenos Aires in one hour and 30 minutes. And afterwards, the flight will continue to Amsterdam. We would like to extend a special welcome to our Flying Blue and Sky Team members. In a few moments, we will show you a video about the safety procedures on board this Boeing 777-300. We will show this in English with Spanish subtitles. On behalf of KLM Royal Dutch Airlines, we wish you a very pleasant flight.
I have to say I'm quite impressed by the uh, selection of entertainment. There's a really good selection of movies, both current and older releases. So all the all the latest stuffs there, Avengers, Bohemian Rhapsody, uh, you know, Mr. Bean or Johnny English, sorry, Mr. Bean. Um, so I'm quite impressed by that. There's also a good selection of TV as well as music uh, and, and games as well. So um, this gets a thumbs up for me in terms of entertainment selection. So. nice flight um, as I say it's very comfortable because it's a long haul aircraft basically um, so you've got the comforts of a long haul flight on such a short flight so Ivan's had his entertainment as you know Ivan loves his in-flight entertainment I like looking out the window um, and the 777 is one of my favorite aircraft as well so it's been a really enjoyable flight that aside when we booked this flight it was also much cheaper than um, its competitor on the route which is LATAM so that's another plus point. Uh, so we've had a great flight. Remember, if you've enjoyed this uh, this video, we have lots of flight reviews and also lots of uh, destination reviews as well, all the different experiences that we have around the world. So why not subscribe to us if you're watching us on YouTube and you can also follow us on Facebook as well. in Buenos Aires and that was our experience of a tag on flight from Santiago over to the Argentinian capital. It's been a really comfortable flight, only one hour and 30 minutes but it's um, a great level of comfort for such a short flight and I'd happily continue the flight up to Amsterdam um, in that seat as well. Also the best thing about this flight was the fact that it was 50% cheaper than LATAM who also fly the route between Santiago and Buenos Aires. And overall, it was a comfortable flight and what is my favorite wide-body aircraft, the Boeing 777. So, thanks very much for watching. Remember, if you are watching us on YouTube, subscribe to us, hit that subscribe button. You can also follow us on Facebook as well and check out our website at www.theglobeguys.com. We're off to explore Buenos Aires now, so thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.